And <laughs> welcome back when it's play XCOM. Anyone known the new one? Oh boy. I had to plan this out. Okay, you just have to leave that area. You just you just gotta move. Okay. We need guaranteed shots here. We can't screw around with this. Okay, you have the best shot. Kill it. Thank you. Okay. The biggest problem as well with the, with the chrysalids killing people is that we're gonna have zombies to get to you afterwards. Oh, the floaters too. And you're out of ammo. Oh man, they have plasma rifles too. This could be a problem. Resistance, everyone's running out of ammo. Oh, it's a feeling right there. And there. Okay, you're out of ammo, so you gotta move. You have to go there. As much as I don't want to do this. Okay. You're also out of ammo. You have to go there. And hopefully... Nothing will come around that corner. You're gonna be flanked. You gotta move there. Okay. Please hit it. Please kill it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Everyone just has to reload. Back There's online. just no way around this. It's time. Oh my god, that thing's... Okay, well, it is... Okay, please kill a civilian. For once, please kill a civilian. Even better, he didn't kill a civilian. Rock. You're the only one who gets cover. Position confirmed. Really? It's right there. F you game. I'm not wasting that. You could die for all I care. We have no good movements. I'm gonna hunker down. Screw that noise. We're hunkering down. Okay. Go here, jerk. You're safe. Now get out of here. I'm gonna run where the engines are. Good, good job, guy. Good, good job. Orders confirmed. On the move. Everyone has to crash. There's just no way around this. Actually, you can run and gun. All ass. So I'm not too worried about you. Ten four. Oh, Actually, more assault would have been really good in this place. Yeah, you're in Overwatch. Scanning. Oh, if we save everyone else, we'll just make it even. Overwatch. Aye, aye. Run. I've got my Hopefully eyes. no one else dies. <laughs> it's totally gonna happen, by the way. Do you hear something? Yeah. Okay, we don't lose instantly, so that's a good thing. You hit that thing? Blah, blah, blah. Moving. Go loud. You're safe. Now get me. Okay, floaters, so I'm not too worried. And there's a scientist. Uh apparently he doesn't want to see anybody. Oh, it's because they're in a building. You know what? I'll take that actually. Move into position. Roger, I've got eyes on. We need to move up anyways. I've got my eyes on. We're just gonna watch it for chrysalids. So we we'll get to this very slowly. But at least we're finally moving out. And we're gonna crash a bit here. 
This mission's not going well. Better than I expected, but not well. That's fine, I don't care. I don't think we're going to do well this month. To be tr truly honest, I think we're going to fail this month. Oh, how am I going to do this? Okay, you need to go here. I'm on the move. Roger, I've got my eyes on. Okay, you need, you need backup. Actually, can no, the heavy can't make it. So, we'll take, take the medic with you. Okay, we gotta approach this very carefully. Move there. Okay, that should be fine to go there. Please kill it. You had over half a chance to kill it for critical. You decide not to do the critical because you fail at life. Uh, save it. And you have to go here. Got it. If you can see it, I'll take a shot. Actually, oh yeah, we can't take a shot and use the rock at the same time. Alright, change plans. We're gonna wait it out. Please kill it. Yes, you at least damage it. I'm just gonna move my clip for my headset. Oh, kill it. I love you. I love you, Heavy. I love your babies. And another one down. <laughs> or is it dead? Yeah, they're dead. I swear, if we get a, if we get like a bad rating for this, I'm gonna complain. This is freaking hard. Nailed him. Yeah, I knew they wouldn't be the last ones, because we got freaking like zombies it. to worry about now. There has to be at least two chrysalids left, in my opinion. So we have like four people we can save now. Woohoo! I'm glad we called XCOM! Shut up, Bob. We almost died. If it for them, we wouldn't be alive today! Yeah. Okay, that's not a chrysalid, but good enough. Kill that! Yes! Please his last one. Yes. Everything by the numbers. excellent, excellent pour, but everyone survived. That's the main thing. We didn't save many people. So I wonder how the panic level went. Yeah. So did you see when I killed Chris Lid? Shut up, Bob. We lost. Did you see Jim die out there on the battlefield? Uh, no, I meant the civilian. Oh yeah, we saw a lot of them die. <laughs> terrible mission was terrible. Oops. Okay, so... Everyone... Looks like they're really taking care of business down there. And without so much as a scratch. Yeah, like I really care. People died! Opportunists limit, um, eliminates the aim penalty on reaction shots and allows reaction shots to cause critical. That's pretty awesome. Execution. No, I'm gonna go for the opportunist. Screw that noise. That's pretty awesome. What can you get? Flush. Fire a shot that causes enemies to come out of cover. Rapid fire. Take a second shot, single target. Each shot carries a, I'll take that, probably. Yeah, rapid fire. Don't think we'd be on flushing people out. Okay. Revive, allows medkits to revive critically wounded soldiers at three point, uh, three point, uh, no, 33% of uh, maximum health instead of giving, st ooh, giving stable stats, pretty good. Rifle suppression of Fire barrage, da da da. Granting reaction fire against a 30 penalty to aim. 
Hmm. I'm gonna give. I don't know. No, you're my heavy. No, you're still my heavy. Okay, you're gonna get revive. Because you're the medic. And. Oh, crap. I hit. Nah, I can do it in barracks, anyways. Chrysalid autopsy available. Because of freaking chrysalids. Panic in Canada decreased by two. Remember, we will that be is watching. terrible. I'm sure the troops will be eager to get out there and even up the body count. Yeah. I know I am already. Um, let's upgrade you too. Okay, so... You're gonna be a suppression guy. And... Heavy. What do I want to give you? Heat ammo. Ooh, 100% damage to robot enemies. Hmm, how many robots have we seen, enemies have we seen so far, you know, group? I don't know, one? Uh, rapid reaction. Da 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 da. I'll take rapid reaction. You watch as a horrible move because it's gonna be like all there is is like robot enemies next, like you know, after this. Um, and yeah, everyone else, yeah. So I'm gonna save now because that was awesome, and if this crashes, too bad. Because that was balls to the walls, awesome. Okay, so we're just gonna go. Until the armor is done. Yay! We can now get freaking armor. Uh, sectoid corpse, chrysalid corpse, skeleton armor. I don't know what that does. One power source. Well, since we can't build laser weapons at the moment, let's do a sectoid autopsy. Why not? We've made a number of interesting discoveries based on the autopsy results of the alien specimen you brought back. The research team is now referring to this particular variation as a sectoid, based on the unusual structure of its internal organs, which we believe to be the product of genetic manipulation. As we've seen in the field, this species also seems to harbor some sort of telepathic ability. That's telekinesis, Kyle. Yes, so, uh, yeah, we don't really need to do that. It's not really going to help us. Our worst suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. They have something else in mind. No kidding. In the long run, really, the sectoid corpse autopsy is not going to help us all. But, eh, must have got done. Actually, since God knows how long this is going to work... Let's, uh, let's, I'll just show you what it looks like when you do, like, the, the basic looking at the autopsy. Also, I'm sure picture. you can make the connection yourself. We've designated this particular specimen as a floater. The research team is continuing in its efforts to determine how the aliens prevented the organic tissue from rejecting the mechanical components, as they seem to work in perfect harmony with one another. So, yes, that's, that's the floater. The Thin Man. The tall one has, up until this oh, point, been yeah. unofficially referred to as the Thin, thin man. man. Initial testing has revealed a concerted effort by the aliens to modify this specimen's genetic structure in such a way as to make it appear human. However, on closer inspection, we seem to have had some trouble concealing the eyes, which appear to be reptilian in nature. Actually, we might have a problem, because we would really like to, uh, get a Thin Man lie for uh, anyways chrysalids based on what we've seen in the field so far including several grotesque examples of trauma resulting from the emergence of its young we've taken to calling this specimen a chrysalid and yeah that's a chrysalid um we do need to do sectoid for a good reason but it's kind of lame okay council report workshop the request from Europe. I've actually been thinking about that now, and I think I might do it. Just for capital gains. It's only nine, right? Eh, why not? Hooray! Money. Capital gains, though. Woohoo. Okay. Autopsy. Contact detected. Oh, look at that. Small scout in Russia. Oh, it's landed! Ooh, and it's small. 
this is a good time to train rookies. Okay. Hmm. You know what? We're doing it. Training rookies. You're on the team. Guess what? You're also on the team. Guess what? You're on the team. Guess what? You're on the team, and we need a new person. How about... Oh, you've two days. This guy. This girl, I mean. Okay, so what are you gonna get? You know what? This is probably a really bad idea. But you know what? Screw it. We need to train these rookies eventually. I'm also do it now. Everyone's freaking support. We don't need that many support. Here we go. Let's get some big, big, beefy, buffy guys. Because, you know, that's going to end well. I wonder what they'll become. Uh, who else do we got? There we go. Okay, your support. So, let's give you... There's no med kits. Oh, no. But, uh, I don't really care. Frag grenade. Okay, everyone's got frag grenade. Okay, you got a med kit. No! I hit the wrong button. You don't need med kits. You need something else. You need frag grenades and support kits med kits. Because that's the way I roll. Yeah. That's a horrible idea. Yeah, yeah, let's go. We need to level up these jerks anyways, eventually. Because when we start losing men and women, we're just going to need more backup people. It's a small scout, so I'm not overly worried. Because even if we lose men, I don't really care. We'll be deploying to Russia for this one. Reports indicate the UFO is set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. And if we do this mission successfully, we will actually, uh... Lose panic in that area, but there is no panic in this area. However, we need to do for council crap. This matter. But it's daytime again. Really daytime. Usually my missions are all at night. Okay, the five of us. Let's go. Hoorah! gonna save because this is a really bad idea and I'm mostly doing this because I'm crazy and I might actually revert if this doesn't work we're in position and awaiting further orders roger that big sky strike one you are green to deploy approach with extreme caution current enemy status at the site is unknown hey the scarver's all over there don't, don't get rid of the fog of war, even though you were that way, but whatever. Rolling. Yeah, I might reload this just because I'm doing this just because I'm like... Eh, I, might as well, I might as well try it, see if I can see how well my strategy is. And we do need to level these people up eventually. Moving. Roger that. Scanning. Um, however, I need a pulse removed. When we get back, more XCOM. Anyone known? The new one.